day 12. So I am now officially in place number five for a few days. So this must be exciting a journey for you to witness me going house hopping place to place until my home comes through because it will it's coming i feel it it's gonna happen so today is definitely a little bit better than yesterday um what did i do i cleaned the other place i was staying at so i've been like kind of running around but then i went for a nice little beach walk and i also went for a run and i feel like the run was really helpful to move the energy within my body because I've been doing so many shifts, like so many energetic shifts, lots of inner work that that energy needs to go somewhere. It can't just like sit there. So it needs to move around. And so if you are doing inner work or in any sort of healing or any shifting in your thoughts, um, to use some sort of movement of whatever that movement is to move that energy. So movement can be you know actually working out going to the gym going for a run yoga hit workout whatever feels right for you or it but it could also be breath work as well is another good way to move things through your body and um, so anything that really requires your more or less your entire body to be to have like kind of like an like feel the energy move through you and so yeah, so that felt really good to just like go for a run and it's like a nice sunny day today. So, and warm actually, like 10 degrees. So it's really nice to be out there. Um, so yeah, the place I'm staying at now is my friend's place. I'm gonna sleep on her couch for a few days and it's um, it's a cute little spot. The Her place is adorable, I love it. Um, and I realized I have something in my teeth. Nope, still there. Okay, well, I'm just gonna... I had popcorn earlier, and I think that's what that is. Anyways, can't really see it that much. I hope now you're not just gonna stare at it the entire time I'm talking. <laughs> um, see, I'm perfectly imperfect, and I'm sharing that. Um, yeah, so here for a few days. Um, so that's the update. What else, what else that I want to talk about? Mm. Okay, so one thing that's been coming up a lot for me, uh, especially from yesterday, but like also the past few days is this thought and I'm realizing the thought, but I'm also shifting the thought. And so I wanted to share with you this thought because I do believe that, sorry, the popcorn is in there. Um, I do believe that I thought I'm not the only one who's had it before. And this thought that basically has been coming up is that it feels like I've gone backwards in terms of my life, like in terms of everything in my life, like I'm currently, I don't have a home, you know, in terms of like my business, like my finances, everything feels backwards to where I was like two months, three months ago. And so this thought is something that's been coming up a lot and I'm recognizing it because I know it's not true, even though it feels like it's true, but I know it's not because I'm not the same person I was two, three months ago. I actually am not the same person I was last week. And so that is the way how I'm shifting through this process right now of Saying like, how can I be going backwards when I've grown myself and I'm not the same person? And even though right now in the evidence, in the physical evidence, it feels like that. But also, does it mean that it's my whole life? Does not mean I'm going to be in this position forever? It means that this situation is just temporary. And so this is how I'm creating a different narrative in my mind. So going from this one narrative of feels like I'm going backwards, because if I truly believe that, then that will truly create that reality in front of me. So I'm shifting through that and it's like, no, I'm not going backwards. I'm actually moving forward, but it's looking a little bit different. 
because I have grown, I have changed, I have done a lot of inner work. And so this is important when you are paying attention to your words and your thoughts. And especially that I've been talking a lot about this in a lot of my IG lives lately of everything we say and things we think will be what well, is what's going to be presented in front of us and so finding ways of what works for you to shift that evidence how can you shift that evidence and what can you tell yourself to think differently because you aren't the same person you were a week ago you aren't the same person you were three months ago and you're not going to be the same like you're going to be someone different in a week from now. You're going to be some like you're going to be someone even more different in 3 months from now. And so you're always shifting and you're always evolving, you're always growing whether you're consciously doing the inner work or not. You still are because you're still experiencing many different things in life on a day to day and everything that you experience is an opportunity for growth and that growth you take that on even if you're not consciously aware of it and by even watching this video watching this video right now you're growing you're changing your thought process in a tiny bit or a major bit whatever resonates and so pay attention to your words and your thoughts and see how you can shift them and even if it's baby steps baby steps because sometimes we can't go from zero to 100 it's extreme but just doing it one thing at a time one day at a time and take it from there so that is day 12 what i have to share because i wanted to share with you how i'm shifting through and recognizing my current thoughts. And so if this video resonated with anybody, if you have any questions, or if there is a thought that you have, like a narrative, a story that you tell yourself, write it in the comments and I'll, I'll respond. I'll respond to it and see how we can shift that. I would love to do that. And so go ahead, please write it. And if not, that's all good too. I'm just happy you watched this video and that's it. So I will speak to you tomorrow for day 13. Every day, yay. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.